So you clicked on this video because you want to find more information about standing seam metal roof seamers. All right, so before we hop straight into the video, I wanna tell you a little bit about myself so you feel comfortable with who you're getting your information from. My name is Zach Flingensop. I'm the owner of a company called Digital Roofing Innovations. I'm a US military veteran and I'm a licensed general contractor and roofing contractor in over nine states. I just want you to feel comfortable that I'm a good person to get information from. All right, let's get started with the video. Okay, so the really cool thing about this video is we're actually on a project right now. We're doing the Blue Ridge Music Center in Galix, Virginia for the National Park Service. So you're gonna to get to see this baby in action. Now in this video, we're gonna talk about three different things. The first thing we're gonna talk about is what an actual standing seam metal roof seamer is. Then we're gonna talk about how it operates and I'm gonna show you the different operations of it. And then we're actually gonna see it install a panel. So what is the standing seam metal roof seamer? Well, this machine, in a nutshell, is basically gonna replace you having to hand crimp all of your seams when you install them. Now obviously, this we're talking about mechanically seamed and we're not talking about snap lock panels. So this machine, in a nutshell, is going to seam up the entire roof. And the great thing about this is it eliminates the errors that you're gonna have with your workers, with them cramping too hard, not cramping enough, so you're gonna get a nice tight seam on all these. And another cool thing is normally these things are all pre-programmed. Whether you're buying or renting, there's a calibration guide on how to use these. So that's basically what it is in a nutshell. This machine is just going to replace you having to hand cramp all of your panels, particularly on these large commercial jobs. Okay, so I rent all of my seamers. And the reason because we do quite a few metal roofing jobs, particularly for the government. However, I don't do enough where I feel like I should own one of these. And another reason I like to just rent them is I use the same company every time. I use DI Seamers out of Corinth, Mississippi. They've got great customer service. And all I have to do is send them my information about the panels that we're going to use. So for instance, on this job, we're installing a McElroy Maxima ADV two inch panel. And so it has to be crimped to 180 degrees. So they pre-programmed this for me. So there's not any extra calibration or anything that, that I have to do out on the job and I don't have to worry about my guys messing it up with their calibration. So it can, comes preset to what I need it to be. And another thing is they deliver them directly to the location that you want in these Pelican cases. And then you have, you have something to be able to return them exactly in that case and they have already posted, already paid. So I think it's a great deal. That's who I use. So how do you operate this thing? Well, guys, these things are pretty simple to use. So all you're gonna do is make sure that it's going in the right way. There's a big arrow that points right here on what direction it should go. So you're gonna install this right on top of your steam. Be careful to make sure that you don't dent or bend any of your seams or your panels. So once you have it installed on here, now it is pretty heavy, so you gotta make sure that you're being careful. And if you need two people, then use two, two people because that's very important not to damage anything. So your panels are going to be pre-crimped uh, as you step, put this on here. And then once you have it on there, each one of these has its own guide on how to use the levers. Uh, on this particular one, you're going to go one, two, three, four, and then you're going to push down on this and it's going to seam up the roof. Now these do require some AC power. And the cool thing is it tells you exactly what you need. So for instance, on this, your requirements is a minimum of a 10 uh, gauge power cord, a maximum length of 100 feet, and a minimum of 20 amp power source. And it tells you exactly what you need here. So whether you're running off generator or AC power that you're gonna get from a building, it tells you exactly what your requirements that you need. And the last thing that you need to know is to make sure you have your guide ropes attached to this. And it shows you exactly on this machine in particular on where to install these. So this is just to help safety, just in case it runs off track, which rarely happens. And then also just to keep everyone safe uh, if this thing was to come off the roof. When you're taking it off, 
Obviously it can be a safety hazard if you don't have any lanyards attached. So you wanna make sure that you have your lanyards attached. Now at the very end of the video, I'm gonna go around the entire uh, machine so you can see all the different components. Now as you flip this thing over, and again, we'll look at this at the very end so you can see in detail. You can see the tracks of exactly where your standing seam goes through. You gotta make sure these things are cleaned out every now and then because as you know, some gunk can get installed uh, or gunk can get uh, stuck in here as you're installing your panel. So make sure these things are nice and cleaned out. And if you have any problems with this part of it, there just may be a simple calibration you may need to use uh, or may need to put into your, into your seamer. Well, without any further ado, let's go ahead and hop on the roof and see this thing actually work in person. Now stick around and I'm going to show you exactly what this thing looks like close up. Okay guys, so we've talked about what this thing is, how it operates, and now you've seen it work on the actual roof itself. Now if you have any other questions, just please leave us a comment here on the video. If you enjoyed the video, please give us a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel a lot. And if you want to see more of our content, please give us a subscribe. Here at Digital Roofing Innovations, we believe in a modern approach with traditional values.